Hello and welcome back to XCOM 2, the team on the ground. It is the Red Wake. We're here in the Advent Forge. It's our way over this way, so let's just get going. Uh, I think, and yeah, Joe here has concealment, so we can lead the way. Of course, we've got the uh, dark event for no concealment for anyone else. And with the alien's extended vision range, we will probably blunder into an alien pod uh, before sneaking up on them. Right, we are clear to there. Let's bring our sniper forward. Coming. Let's get Karis down on the front lines. I won't be long. Uh, crow father. This is the way. Let's see. There's only one way to find out. And shenanigans. Who am I, the road runner? Let's come for the fort with the crew, Father. Gotcha. I don't want to get uh, ahead of our scout, Joe. So let's just chill out here. Gotcha. Of course, we've got the uh, chosen coming in straight away to be uh, revealed. I thought we had the assassin first up, or does the one that appear on the story mission, like assassin? is first so it comes on the first one then this guy was second so he comes on the second mission is that how it works i don't know never paid attention anyway this guy fair useless any type of scene we've absolutely decimated him not even Karis is scared of him sneaking about the back of the map bring it on i ain't scared oh, and we've got a Lancer, mute on testicle, two Lancers back there. I'm sorry. Toxic Trooper, that's not a very threatening pod is it? Camera takes off. Let's start with shagans. We've got. It's obviously a night time because we can't see anything. Let's bring it shagans oh forward. I'd like to get Karis over this side as well to shotgun any lances that approach. Okay, good shot from shagans. From here, let's fire in. Got blue screen rounds, have to remember that. Uh, then you get a, another action because you revealed yourself. Just move into that cover. G Man eyeing up that toxic trooper. Let's see. That's too slow to do anything, aren't you, Betsy? I don't know, I guess. Let's come to here and we'll see if we can get through the Ford with our charge ability and get a shot off. Should be able to get a flank shot from there. It is a bit dangerous because, uh... Fella there will have a grenade. I think the flank shot is probably going to do more than the explosive. Oh, and it does. Betsy takes his head off. <laughs> 10 damage is pretty big for a uh, pistol. Let's bring a Betsy to here. We know there's a guy hiding around the corner. Okay. Back to two of them. Sneak okay. across here with G Man. Cover him. Right. And let's bring Karis. To that point I there. Wish. We can use her reaction fire. I think we still got Crowfather as well. Let's bring Crowfather over this way here, ready to help out with this guy. Just soften him up with a grenade. Let's 
Why is it never a fair play? Whoop, hello, there's the sector pod. He's coming in with Toxic Trooper, Purge Heavy, Bio Assault, Frost Lancer, Snake. Oh, that's a Frost Trooper Stun Lancer. Okay, so the Robot Dangerous, the Snake Dangerous, the Purge Heavy does big damage. That Bio Assault pretty thick, and there's another pod right there. Taipan, Frost Priest, Lancer, Side Trooper, that pod there is none too dangerous. All you oh, everything's active. All right. Next turn is going to be a frisky one. Good damage there from Keras. Couldn't finish him off. Luckily, Joe's there. I am honored that you require my skill. Nice. The reaction fire on the rifles. Doing good. Jack there didn't move, so we didn't get a sniper shot, which is disappointing. Uh, but his cover exploded, which is good. Start with that. Now this is what I call a haymaker. Now I'd really love to know. There's the sector. He's right by those explosives. We snuck forward a little bit, keeping in full cover. We're even moving to half cover and getting some smoke. I okay. think we can blow that explosive with the sector pod to shred everything. Yeah, look at that. Die. Get it on target, it'll be a thing of absolute beauty. Oh, that's disappointing. Well, let's do it the old-fashioned way then. Nice. Right, Betsy here. You've got an acid bomb. Let's do that as well. Just shred him right down. Brilliant, you've hit everyone else as well. All looking good for the team here. Shenanigans, I'd like to get you in some full cover. You've also got this uh, rail gun. I just don't want to have people uh, grouped up at the moment. Uh -huh. Trouble is, we've got no vision thanks to the nighttime mod, so we have to push up pretty aggressive probably next turn. Let's reload. Good, buddy. Bring Joe forward a bit. And G Man, the only unit we can snipe at is that Vanguard, which I'm okay with. Sure. And Kiris. I don't want anyone getting railed by the sector pod if we could help it. Jump to there. A wise decision. Bunch of units over that way. Let's try and flashbang some of them. Happy with that? Sort your turn out, alien. Oh, was that Betsy hit? It was. Okay, just take it the back there on fire, that's fine. Stand back there and fire. Come forward, you jerks. We are no good at this distance. We need you to advance so we can get in there. That was a close one. Shot in from shenanigans. Oh, 
Still wish that only went off once per uh, the fuck down. turn on a unit like that. End this now, quickly. Crow father hit. It's all on the ablative though. Anyone but the sectopod, please. Thank you. The Vanguard rushing in. Ah, G man missed. Okay, the Vanguard missed, that's fine. We'll pull Crowfather back to that full cover we were in before. Then what else are we going to do? Who knows? Get aggressive. Now let's start here with this. It's a pretty easy move. Gets the flank of that Vanguard. Keep up. Oh, hello. I forget he's got uh, Overwatch because we can't see him. We're going to have to get Crowfather healed up. Hang in there. Means we're a shot down on the Vanguard. Podcast killed. Oh, luckily it didn't matter. That is fantastic. Let's reload. Done. Let's see. Uh, you were hit, but it was all on the ablative. There's a few guys at this corner here. Let's just take... Jesus. Not what I wanted at all. You were supposed to be on that side of the wall, taking cover from the big sector pod, Betsy. Uh, let's just walk to there. Shenanigans. Such a short range on it. Push forward. All right. Can't even hit both of you. Is it worth wasting a rail gun on that? I don't know that it is. Ah, oh, shenanigans. That's awful. Come on. Come on, shenanigans, in your turn. Everyone's sick of your embarrassment. Now, we know there's a bunch of guys up here. Let's get the frag grenade thrown at this corner. Hopefully blow the front of this truck. I smell fire. Got a covering fire shot on someone, maybe. G man. Got a cover target on the sector pod. Okay. Harris. Come there. That uh, blew up last turn, so that should be fine. I shall do my best. Us. That one's out of the way. Betsy's the only one we can see thanks to the vision range there, which isn't helping. Let's go another frag grenade back here. It's I blow this truck. Take out one or two of those units. What? I could have sworn that that explosion out of the truck used to only come back to one tail past the cab. So the back of the truck was fine to stand at. That's really annoying shredding Betsy's armor there. Has that explosion radius changed? I'm I need just like two tiles from the explosion which is at the cab. End 
Yeah. I don't know how. Actually got dinged there. But so be it, I guess. Alright, good shot from Joe, but he's still going to get clubbed. Or he would do if he wasn't so nimble. Well done, Joe. Coach Heavy moving around. A toxic trooper. Very good. I am under attack! Oh, shenanigans. She's corroding there, hit by that Taipan at long range. Kara shot by the cursed trooper. That is a bad wound indeed. Okay, the blind there missing Betsy, which is good. All right, uh, Betsy. Who are we going after? I don't know. We use Fracture on this big fellow. Shenanigans. Get the mid kit on Keras, who got Blitz there for five. And let's also shoot yourself. Clear that corrosion which is going to tick down. Go, let's push. Board. Take the flank on that Lancer. Oh, you didn't finish him off. That's a bad mistake. Only two damage, huh? Let's cover him then. Garrus. Let's jump. No, ammo, Garrus. Reload. Of course. Father, come forward. Yeah, I'm coming. Nice, Crowfather deals with him. I think I took a little too much off the top. But that frosty snake in there that we really can't deal with at the moment. Let's just dive Straight to that up. cover. Okay, so big snake, purge heavy, sectopod, toxic trooper, priest, and the lancer. I seem to remember a time when that lightning field did damage to units around it. Lining up the cannons, we have to move over our next turn. That snake has found Crowfather, which is rather annoying. No! Hey man, us. Shot that one up your ass. Yeah. Okay, he's on Overwatch there. That's okay. Oh no, it's so hard when I have no idea who's got sort of flanks in that direction because we don't have lines of sight. All right, let's see. Watch out for that cannon. Don't want to waste the grenades at the stage if we can get away with it. 
shenanigans. You might have to move. I don't know how big that wrath cannon is. Reload here. Good buddy. Thirty three to hit is poor. Let's reload. Why are you chilled? Surely you can't be. Oh, you got shot by that frost priest, which we can't really do anything about. Let's fall back. Of course. Hey man. Cover the big fella. Good. Garrus. Of course. Down to him in one. Well done, Karras. That frees up Crowfather. So move. I say flank that priest, but we can't see him from there. That's a very frisky place to be. The heavy's back here. Bit too close to that heavy for my liking. Oops. Okay. Gone to that tile. I wasn't really meaning to. Then we've got that Taipan there. Let's come forward, take I'm a flank coming. shot at the Taipan. Then we can bring Keras up to free you if he comes into the bind or something funny again. Oh, that's right, they got a return fire ability. I forget that. Fucking drugs, ASAP. Um, we've got no drugs. Tough it out, I believe in you. You really ought to fall down when I hit you like that. And then we've sort of movement action. Move to the full cover. Left here. And that leaves us a bitsy. Ah, oh, Crowfather is dead. He died to the uh, Requiem corrosion there. Priest is dead. He died to the sector pod. Very good. Who's our covering fire shot? What do we lose? Nope. We've still got line of sight to him. Nice. Up he goes. Oh, Crowfather. Cut down just as we were making progress. Yeah, the snake at the back reloading. Is it just the three left? I think it might be. Push forward with Keras. Let's use a sprint for the bonus action. Sprint to here, get right up in this Taipan's grill. She has lightning reflexes, so that's fine. Nice. That's sort of what I was attempting last turn, but with Crowfather being alive. Let's bring... Okay, we can flank him from there, but it's not very good cover. I think Shannigans will be fine, she's tough. Well done, Shannigans. Yo. Really achieving anything. G Man can cover him. Okay. Let's see. Move forward. Uh, okay. Chance to hit is a 50 50. Might as well take it. Nicely done. Boosh. Alright, so I think that should be. First half of the map done. Now we get on to the hard half. 
You hunker down. Right, grab some more coffee there quickly. Uh, we are on Betsy, Betsy, come forward. Usually end up with a pod or something guarding, sort of bridge across. Let's get everyone pushed up, reloaded. Oh, okay. Good, buddy. Trying not to have the mission take too long. I'm sure everyone would prefer a fast mission over a slow and tedious one. She man, that corner of the building is that going to be? Slightly closer, isn't it? Let's dash wildly in this direction here in Come hopes on. of getting up there. Harris, let's move forward. As you wish. I want to get that reload in with you. That's going to be crucial. Yes. So no pod yet. Let's Which bridge do we want to come to? Let's come to this back bridge here and see if we can get a sniper up on the roof. I think that might be a better plan. You can trust me. You know. Probably. Shotgun! Bring shenanigans across. I will stop, but I will not apologize. So shall it be done. You to the G-Man, let's get you up. Just come to that first floor, it should be fine. Um, there. Come on. Quickly. Jump across with Keras. Okay, so we can hear a pod. Looks like they are at the building, or forge, or whatever it is supposed to be. Us moving up towards Let the bridge. Try. Okay, that's good. Let's stick Keras right in the front. Full cover against anything crossing. And let's get everyone else moving up. Keras, a bit too far ahead of the pack. Lines of sight from that corner, I would imagine. Yes. You felt it, yes. Yeah, that looks like it's coming from the same location. Some noisy monster up there. You're so slow, Betsy. Oh, totally. Right, let's get Shenanigans into cover there. Where Let's get Joe Ford. Oh, we can see a pod there failing to hide in the fog. XCOM, fix your fog of war. I was just going to come forward and see if there was any high ground we can get in, and there is there. Question is, do we go for it now? I think we do. Got it. Yes. Uh, let's bring shenanigans to here. Yeah. Got caught in the middle of this bridge, it's no good. We have to push up to this end so we can get some full cover. I sense something ominous lurking in their shadows. Get ready. Here they yeah. come. So they are coming in. We've got this green captain bloke. Toxic captain, cursed trooper, riot trooper, stun lancer. It's not very threatening by the look of it. Frost lancer, probably the biggest threat. So slow, Betsy. 
Right, what are we doing first up? We've got no eyes on them, which is a trouble. Eris can use her grapple to fly. Oh, up there. Yes. Get going. I just want you forward, Karis. Then let's drop down to the... Can't see anything in this darkness. Oh, but we can see a building. Very good. Who thought that was a good idea to put in a game? Genuinely. I don't know. Some people. It doesn't even show anything. It's just a building and we can see it from here. Hey, why shut from Karis? It just winds me up so best. much. Ah, uh, Betsy. Get racing forward. There's only one way to find out. Shenanigans. Let's jump into uh, that corner there. Well. Right from here. The bio trooper. No good. Who's that flanking there? The advent marksman. Let's suppress bio tripper. Joe Ford, it's terrible cover. That's all we got. 84% shot there is nice. Let's take that. Well done, Joe. G man, I really want to get you dashed up here. That tile is less flanked. Marked. Good shot from Shenanigans. Oh, for seriously? Uh, I think he's actually cheating and going to reassess his action. He does. Harris takes him out. Nice. Oh, Shenanigans, sharp. The marksman moving back, that's fine. This guy here, the big threat, he's got the melee attack. Oh, for seriously? End this now, quickly. Then we've got a riot trooper moving around. I'll run with Keras first to run the overwatch, then I don't really know what the plan is. Uh, I want to save our grenades if we can. You've got a 73% shot. You are so good. You get like open fire, eagle eye. Let's try and clear at least one overwatch. Good man. Harris can run that overwatch from that trooper. And jump to that spot there, flanking that frost lancer. Let's see. Let's dash forward, make you a bit of a target. Wait, what? Actually, he might have a goo grenade, mightn't he? Try the flashbang this turn. Just sorry at them, stop a grenade coming in at Betsy and Joe. And G Man from here. Cover that bio trip. Oh, he's gone down anyway. That's fine. But just the marksman back here. Those two. End this now, quickly. Doors opening. Might be another pod coming to their rescue. Uh, we have to get the treasure. That's surely the job of. I should say Betsy, but I want Betsy to come forward and flank. <laughs> right. 
us of the void with you, I'm Trooper. Wet just thinking about it. This kills for Betsy, not costing an action with the pistol. Shenanigans, reload. Good buddy. Turn ending, reload there. Nice. Joe has been on form this mission. Garrus, let's push you forward. I don't know whether that marksman's on Overwatch. Doesn't appear to be. Reload. It's done. Never standard Overwatch there. Sure. Oh, then we got a red heavy gunner. Commander. Mech Scout, Frost Trooper. Purifier, Lancer Trooper. That's not a very big pod, is it? Is that a separate pod there? I think there's a separate pod at the back, so there's another one there as well. Alright, so I'm going to assume there's still a guard pod. Possibly one pod in that corner there where the evac spawns. Let's get Betsy moving up this way. Really? In the right place to be the front lines this time. Oh, Betsy downs the scout. Only four health in him. He, he was a weak one, the little tier one unit. Shut up, Bitsy. Uh, no match for us. Let's reload, I think. Shenanigans. Let's push you forward. We're a go on operation. I want you to cover Betsy. There's a couple of lances and things there, so if they run forward, you should get shots at them. Same deal for Joe. As you wish. Harris. I really don't know where that marksman went. Of course. That's him cowering there. Yes. I wanted to be the gruff but lovable driver, mechanic, and maybe occasional muscle, right. like a folksy BA Baraka. Hey, we've got a set of shields up, that's alright. Lancer coming in, here's Joe. Interesting, Shenanigans didn't get any covering fire there. Line of sight surely couldn't have been an issue, she's two tiles away. He just fly up to the roof, did he? All right, Shadigans, you are obviously on this idiot. Thank you. Kiris, you are all right there. Let's jump to that half cover. Of course. Out of the way. Uh, Frost Trooper, something else in the Marksman. The um, red suited Commander Man. That's who I've lost track of in this. I suppose Betsy is going to come forward. Purifier as well, okay. Really prefer it if Betsy did not get set on fire here. Right. There's the commander at the back. Oh, jeepers, that's a big hit. Watch out, Betsy. I found your weakness. 
shooting her with bullets. All right, Frost Trooper takes off, G-Man. No good. That's disappointing. That's the way, Keras. Don't take any of his nonsense. Joe's back on his feet. Betsy, that commander there absolutely destroyed you. I want to try and hold off on using the med kit. Shagans has an AOE heal, which I want to get and fire at everyone, I think, at this stage. I don't know, I guess. Oh, Shagans, that's no good. him down Joe. Oh, he's still going. Now that leaves us Keras who has to reload unfortunately. Let's move. There. Of course. Let me try. Um, I don't want to shoot him if he steps forward, because I think it counts as moving to that tile, which will blow up Betsy. We'll cover that guy. Sure. Although, the reaction fire from Joe and Shagans might put him down anyway. At least then, it wasn't my choice. That's okay, he's ducked into cover. Not, not the grenade. You filthy jerk. He's missed. Shameful. Grenade scatter works our favour once again. So there was another pod still, correct? I lost count or not paying attention. One of those two things. Let's bring Betsy to there. It's a little bit of sort of half cover. I don't know what angle this guy has. Frost Trooper might have a Frost Grenade. In fact, probably does, but we can't see him. Let's bring... Let's reload, Joe. Push forward. G-Man can see nothing. Let's have an Overwatch. Garrus. Yes. Get forward. Whoa! No. No, that was a bad move, wasn't it? I forgot the pot. Just talked about it. Okay, so we've got a Taipan of some sort. We've got a, another Frost Lancer back there. Purge bloke. It's a Taipan Dragoon. I don't think I've seen that one. Uh, cursed Trooper, Toxic Trooper, Psy Trooper. I don't know how you can manage to say there's a pod up there, be careful, the next move pretty much just activate them. Gonna be fired from my XCOM command, surely. Want to get the heal on everyone. Problem is, I don't know how much vision range Shadigans has, whether she can see Keras there or not. Let's bring Betsy into that gap there. Really? Surely we can see her from there. 
Once again, oh just missing God. the ability to preview friendly targets. Let's fire everyone. We don't heal Kara Sevier. Yeah, we did. That's <laughs> so irritating. I mean, surely we can see that far, can't we? It'd be nice if uh, when you selected this unit, then uh, he vanished from sight on the map. That'd be a great way to show how far you can actually see. Okay, let's move forward. <laughs> Joe! Getting that gap there. Whoop! Oh, tagged by the Frost Trooper. That's nice. And cover that sniper. I'm all right with that. Harris needs to reload. Grapple up here, we can. Let's grapple to here, I want to move behind that full cover object and then reload. Ready to sprint out and attack him next turn. Alright. As you wish. That should be a grand spot to ambush from. Whoops, I left uh, shenanigans there flank because I moved Betsy off. What idiot. Oh, that's a mighty cannon. Just playing so poorly this mission. Oh, as bad as G-Man as the old saying goes. Good shot, gets his shields down. Hey, nice. Frosty Purifier is a dangerous foe. Can't you grenade someone, you jerk? Hey, the miss, that's fine. I think that was his frost grenade that went off. It's, it's so hard where uh, they've got so much more vision range than we do. I don't know whether the uh, vision range penalties are applying to uh, the enemy or not. I don't think they are. All right, so we have to move away from this truck. Let's push forward with Betsy. Wait, you think it's safe? I don't think it's safe, Betsy, but we've got no other choice at the moment. Okay, he goes up, that's fine. And takes out the uh, chappy there, I like that. Bounce to hit 71, not bad. Go, okay, Betsy. Get these shields down. Big help. Uh, shenanigans, you need to get into some cover, love. Let's go... there. Even reload. Hopefully they'll push up and try and hit Betsy. And watch out for the snake who's somewhere at the corner. There, do I want to throw a flame grenade? Probably do, try and set him alight. Bro looks a bit short, is it? Ah, got him. Well done. Use this opportunity to reload. Cover target, let's cover... the yeah, Toxic Trooper, because he doesn't have his shield up. And Karras, we know the snake is down here somewhere. Alright. Uh, I'm trying to see where he is. Is he in that corner there? Must be. Let's 
use sprint. Jump to there. As you wish. At least flanking. Uh, what's it? Cursed trooper. And is flanking the snake. Nice. It's done. There we go. Keras's ambush worked out. See there, returning fire, marking the units, I like that. Karras, deadly as always. The fool is dead. That was a close one. All right. So, from here, let's see. Reload. Fix it. Shenanigans, love to push up. Who has a grenade? I don't know what this veteran commander carries. He sounds like if he was going to carry anything, you'd only have a flashbang, but he is on Overwatch. So let's run that Overwatch with Keras. That's a good idea. Didn't draw the overwatch, that's annoying. It's done. Shenanigans, I think we're fine, just hunker down. I will stop, but I will not apologize. Joe, hunker down. G Man, do we want to get onto this roof here for a change? I think we do. Alright. Close in, I can't tab away. Have you seen something? Oh, we've run past the windows. Whoops. Oh, I can't tap away because it was the end of the turn. But fine. I thought I'd really mess that up. Okay, so we're going to keep pushing Keras out here, flanking this commander. And hopefully get someone to surprise him from behind. Debuff there for Betsy. Nice, that's going to take down his shield. Isn't it? This was a hit, surely. That was a close one. Yes. Just didn't animate up close, that's fine. Oh, we're going to watch out for the Chosen as well. Sort of forgotten about him. Whatever the AI changes I've got, I think it's a Reshi's one. Um, Very well. Doesn't seem to use his uh, mark the target. As you wish. Is that true, Rishi? Does your hunter not do anything at all? As he's seeming very ineffectual, unlike Betsy. As effectual as you like. Uh, let's dash across, keep him flanked, give him something to think about. Shenanigans, let's push you forward. Let's even come to, say, there. And then we can cover him from up there. Good. Nice, a G Man on target. Oh, that's a super aggressive move. But he had to reload. I thought Joe was a gunner there. <laughs> He's just going to jump across and just blaze him down. That's fine. We got away with it. Joe, celebrate with a kill. Or don't. Who armor? Hmm. Hope I haven't messed up. Surely we've got him. Uh, we got sprint from Keras. And get point blank. I think that sprint ability needs. There's much to be done. Uh, I was going to say an extra timer because it seems like not long ago we just sprinted off the roof. But I suppose it's got three turns. Whoops. Perhaps never give up, do you? one more would uh, make that ability just a bit more balanced. Is that a flank from there? It's not. We've got to teleport somewhere. Oh, 
jumped on Betsy. Oh my God. And let's reload, get ready to You're assault the building. Supervisor. Uh, I think we can push to there. Oh, okay. Push up toward the main door. Will we? Or do we want to come in this way here and maybe flank our way through the building? Let's go through the building, seeing we've opened up a new doorway there. Dash forward with Betsy. One way to find out. Shenanigans, get over this side here. We're changing plans. Closer, I can't see Jack Dick. Joe, push forward. I want to reload. Keep some eyes on that window. G man. Uh, some windows there which might be useful. Let's push up. Come on. Reload. Reloading. And Keras. Come forward with us. Hide behind right. Betsy. Fill up that last shot of yours. It's done. Next turn we storm in. I think there's only gonna be one. Two pods. And the chosen and possible reinforcements. Can we get with Betsy? Uh, okay. Assuming the sort of central guard pod there. I don't know. I guess. And one more over the other side of the map. They aren't civilians. They're Advent. Yes, and judging by the subject's condition. I would say it was recently manufactured. No wonder they just keep coming. See, are they manufactured? I think it would make a, make a better reveal if it was revealed they were just humans. So they're doing like a human alien hybrid program. Which I thought is what was going on. But they're melting down all the people to make soft drinks in the, uh. What should we call it? The first uh, black site you do. I don't really know what the plot is. They seem to keep changing exactly what's going on with the story, it seems. Or at least I find that. They'll say something and then contradict each other. Um, let's get ready to maybe peek in these windows. Next turn. We can hear a pod back there guarding the uh, commander's pajamas or whatever it is we are uh, grabbing here. Yeah, pointless grabbing of a stasis suit because when they rescued the commander in the first cutscene, he was wearing one, so they already got one. So that is a door. Can we see through this door? I've got a feeling that this door here is actually uh, transparent. All right. That seems not. That's fine. I just had it in my mind that that door there wasn't working properly. Or at least had failed me in the past to be a door. Now we're finding Advent. Something tells me they didn't abduct these ones. Looks more like a production facility to me. The configuration is different. Is it possible? Could this be where the Advent forces are coming from? Nothing is beyond the realm of possibility when dealing with the well, aliens. If it is, we'll blow it up on the way out. We'll stop them making Advent. Just have a pretty easy end to the campaign, eh, guys? I assume that's what they're talking about. Uh, let's bring a sniper over here. Come Get on. ready to go in that window. I'm just worried about a pod being down here. Usually get a gatekeeper on this, but I don't know that we're far enough along in the um, 
force level to get one. I don't know whether it's a fixed gatekeeper or it's just usually that late in the mission that you're doing this. Uh, let's push up. Nice and aggressive. Sounds like another sector pod. You, Otto von Jismark. Uh, we've got... Oh, it's a goggle wide freak. <laughs> you makes me laugh so much. Nice shot, Keras. We've got a Vanguard with a size sniper. Oh, Keras on the rampage. It's done. Uh, two stun lancers and a bio trooper. What do we do from here, Shadigans? Surely we have to open fire at this guy. He's going to return fire with a coring lance. But because you're behind a plot device, I don't think he can destroy it. Oh, I thought he was going to fire the coring lance, but he's put her in stasis. That's an interesting move. I love it when the AI does something you absolutely have no idea it can do. Uh, let's sprint with Keras. Ooh, at that point there, flanking that size sniper. The fool is dead. Oh, uh, let's dash in with Betsy. Hopefully, put her in the crosshairs of the. Uh, what is he called? Mectoid. He's a different variant of Vicarious. Uh, let's... Is that a good spot? Surely it's a good spot. I shall hurry. I'm more worried about these lances than anything else at the moment. Have you got a hair trigger? See in the window. It's really annoying. Um, hmm. no sneaky shot from there. Let's just come across. Good. And we'll have a standard. Whoop! Hello. We've seen the hunter. Hello. Busted, you stupid freak. Sure. Let's do that. Marked shenanigans firing in. Oh, for seriously? That's the coring lance. I thought he was going to fire that first up. You've got blue screen rounds. I thought he was a robot or robotic, at least in some fashion. Oh, for seriously? Oop, Garrus, what was that? Have you fallen over? Are you just going to point at him? Did he get set on fire and then reassess his action? I think Shenanigans shot him. Yeah, so he actually caught fire. That's what went on there. All right. Oh, we got Hellweave on Karis. It's finally paid off. Oh, stink bomb. Joe gets poisoned, that's annoying. Oh, Betsy, out of the way, is fine. You man. Say hello. Cunningly wait until he's out of line of sight to fire. I like it. But big damage. Shoots <laughs> Betsy, what a jerk move. Don't stand for it, Betsy. Got her again. Hey, I want to get Joe healed. That's step number one. I don't think Betsy can move. She's going to get... Why? Is Betsy immune to poison or something weird? Or did you get sick there, Betsy? It doesn't look like she's poisoned, does it? Oh, she's immune. Well done, Betsy. Let's heal. Go. 
go. Is it because you got the med kit? And we've got the old school rules of carrying a med kit makes you immune to poison for reasons. Which I always hated. I would prefer a separate sort of uh, gas mask or something. Uh, shenanigans. You can nearly line up the two of them with your mighty gun. What if we came here? Could we? Oh, uh, not shotgun, railgun. That's the way shenanigans. <laughs> Absolutely devastating. Fire through that heavy plot cover you've got there. Uh, Joe, you're going to get covered in goo if you move. I should have moved you out of there, shouldn't I? Foolish. Let's take on that Lancer. Nice. I have no match for these foes. Uh, gee, man. Down to here. Right. I'm going to cover that bio trooper. Or who are you paired with? You are paired with a Joe there. Cover him. Let's get Karis reloaded. No, oh, that was a turn ending reload, you idiot. Oh, thank you. Thank you, G-Man. However, if he can see you, you might be dead. I can't believe I left Karis out in the open. You get so used to reloads not ending the turn, it gets to something like this, you just mess it up completely. Alright, so Joe there has the... Blue screen round, Shenanigan sets him on fire, that's nice. Alright. From here, let's start with Joe. You're obviously on the robot. Let's reload. Okay, can't finish him off. G-Man, you are obviously on. A teamwork action. I know we're all tired. We just need to push through. Now... Fire. Us. I am honored that you require my skills. Then cover him. Good. Kiris, come forward. I shall do my best. Alright, down he goes. Big shot there from Kiris. Forces him back. Betsy, you can. I was going to say get the treasure, but I want you dashing towards the escape, oh, which is invariably going to be on this side here. Do we have a frag grenade to blow out the walls with anyone? I don't know that we do. Well. Let's grab that. Let's reload shenanigans. It's awful loot on this one. Looks like Pam's lucky night. Good buddy. I don't know whether this mission might have a different loot table or fixed loot of some kind, because that was awful. And uh, the other drop we got outside was awful also. Uh, you've got flame grenade. No, so we got no cheeky grenade to open up a path out. Who got hammered there? Shenanigans hit for four and Keras was hit for some. Which do we heal? Probably Keras. With her sprint ability, she's going to be grabbing the uh, fancy Halloween costume. So, Keras, come here. All right. Get a free heal from G Man. Just return the favor. Then let's put Keras in that position or close to it. Yes. Everyone else are reloaded and start to make our way out and around the side to where the uh, final reinforcement pod is going to be. Get in closer, I can't see Jack Dick! Uh, let's...
let's get up there. Come on. Okay, so there's no pod there at the moment. Weird camera positioning. Uh, Betsy, let's get you racing out and around the corner. Let's get around. Yeah. What a rush! Joe, get you out here also. Get reloaded. Reloaded. Lock and load. Oh no, Karis, uh, move to here and then reload. Cause turn right. in and reload. We've also got overdrive serum as well for more movements. We can use that. Then sprint. And we should be good. Steady weapon. What I'm worried about is Betsy being so far from the evac. She's got a teleport. Let's just do it and see which direction we're headed. Usually it's about there where that plane is. Uh, so let's use Overdrive Serum. Reaction. I'm pretty sure we can activate Sprint while carrying someone, but we'll activate it first just to make sure. Okay, reinforcements are dropping there. That's fine. Where's our evac is the big question. Even Bradford says it's just like the one we've already got. Finished his sentence for him before Tygen rudely interrupted. Oh no, the evac's on this side. As you wish. Once again, this is the sort of thing you should be able to call in an evac for and uh, put it where you want. Let's get... Harris dashing to there. Yes. Let's get Betsy moving forward. You can trust me, you know. Shenanigans. Probably. Let's get Racing Ford. They're not going to come in with Bring actions, it. so at least that's one saving grace. I am on it. Okay. All right, so we've got. Vanguard and some other blokes. You know, you Advanced Aegis have. Trooper. Two veteran Vanguards and a scout. Alright, uh Betsy. Oh, close combat specialist, that's right. The uh, veteran vanguards have that, which I need to remember for the campaign going forward. Spoiler, I won't ever remember. Uh, shenanigans. Come to that point there. Hopefully that's not close enough to take a close combat shot. It is. Really don't have a counter to it at the moment. We're sort of squeezed in this little gap here. Well done, shenanigans. Uh, there's the other Vanguard. He's upstairs. Not a lot we can do about that. Come forward with Joe. Twenty-six to hit. That's awful. Uh, G-man, let's jump across. Okay. Over him. Okay. Karas, do we put down the body? Is, it, is this one of the missions where it keeps having reinforcements? I think it is, isn't it? That's a good idea. Oh, uh, so let's get there with Karas. Uh, let's just send her home. Very well. Hmm, 
really wish we had something. Let's go move it. I'm gonna say on Betsy, because she's so slow. But we cannot hunker down. Good shot. Yeah, he's got a shield up. Plus again, I hate all these AoE shield units. Quite like the Aegis Trooper with his individual shield, though not checking whether he's already got the shield before casting it. Foolish. I mean, the shield bearer is the specialty unit which carries the the sort of group shield. I I I hate modders taking an ability, sort of a signature ability of a unit like the shield bearer, and just giving it to generic units. Of course. Uh, let's. All right, so G band can dash out. Betsy is nowhere close. Shenanigans is not close either. And we have to run this close combat shot. Right, so Betsy, you gotta go first. No, I don't want to. Oh, oh. Oh, I wish this teleport was a free action. Uh, let's... Activate fold module to there. How to get shenanigans out of there without drawing the overwatch. We just run it with G-Man. G-Man hasn't been shot yet. Go home, G-Man. Okay. Clear the overwatch for us. No, it's a close combat shot. It's not an overwatch. What am I doing? You've just messed that up entirely, you idiot. Pretty good. Absolute idiot. Ah, uh, charge. Charge to there. Really? A teamwork on oh, shenanigans. <gasps> oh my god, what if I have psychokinetic powers? Shenanigans, you're just gonna lig it out. Come on, let's go already. Well done. Oh, you had lightning reflexes anyway. I thought Keras was the only one with lightning reflexes. Well, curses. And let's come to that full cover. Wild well, shot from Joe. I am under attack. Flashbang is fine. And you've got some smoke. All good. Oh, Betsy used charge so she can't get out. And Joe disoriented so he's got little movement. Uh, off we go. Oh, Betsy. Really? Betsy. Oof, 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 one more shot to dodge. One. one more shot to dodge. All right, we are away. All right, 
pretty good mission apart from the loss of Crowfather early on. At 52 enemies, 4 wounded, 1 killed. 36 turns, what a monster. Alright, the red wake back. Uh, promotions for most, memorial for Crowfather. There we go, good shot of Crowfather there. So, even without their team leader, the red wake, get it done. Avatar progress reduced by three, that's good because it was uh, right up there. Alright, so I think it's nearly time we start uh, working on some armor upgrades. Uh, we've got the Codex Brain going, then we might do the armor research, then do the stasis suit, then plasma weapons. Uh, once again, I wanted to see what force level we're at, but I have to click on the accursed map to do it. Just show me the information here. There's, there's so much room to just give you everything you need to know about the game. Winds me up. Winds me up. It's a strategy game. I want to plan things based on information, not guess the information by going to another screen. Grumble, grumble. Right. Harris. Whiplash. Frenzied fire. Can't take melter gun. Let's take whiplash. Free electrical attack once per mission. Super good. Stat points on Keras. Let's go. One mobility. Let's see. Next tier for you. We've got reflex. When fired upon, gain one extra action. Once a mission. So bad. Such a bad perk. Priority target. 10 aim, 10 crit. Nice. Magnum. 10 aim plus one damage. That's 10 aim. I want bonus crit or plus one damage. Let's go. Plus one damage. Might come back and pick that up as we go on. Stat points, we got 30 to spend. Let's go. One mobility. And one aim. Go to dodge to will. Shenanigans. We've got hostage protocol. You're not using a gremlin, so we're going to ignore that. First contact or survivor. Let's go. First contact. More wild rifle shots. Stat points 30 to spend, one mobility. Go, one defense, one aim, one will, one dodge. Finally, a G Man, Gavin Rash. We got Arc Lance. Fire at Arc Thrower. You're not even using your Arc Thrower. Why have I got you with a sniper rifle when you've got this? Well, concealed or flanking, plus two damage, or frenzied fire. Let's take Arc Lance. Let's get rid of the sniper rifle. Alright, so we're going to switch a G-Man here over to the uh, Bullpup. I don't know whether we've had a look at the Tier 2 Bullpup yet. Uh, but we got Suppression and Point Defense on that. Is that a Tier 1 Bullpup? 3 to 5 damage? Maybe. Stat points for G-Man. 21 to spend. Let's go. 1 Mobility and 1... Dodge. All right, so back to the uh, Geoscape here. Force levels, force level eight moments. Okay, I said I wasn't going to do the uh, plasma weapons until like ten or eleven. So hopefully by the time we got armor and that, Advent will get their uh, act together and uh, up the force level a bit. Now, at this stage, we need some more. Anything? No. Grab some alien alloys. He powers up, that's fine. They are really ineffectual. We've found the stronghold. That's Mr. Reaper. Leo and Jackal there doing a good job. All right, so we don't have anyone for the uh, part three hunts. Uh, remove a dark event that's eviscerate. I don't care. Resistance order. Don't really care. Reduce avatar progress might be the way to go. We don't want any skirmishes or supplies or skirmishes. Weapon upgrades are boring. I think we're just going to reduce the avatar progress here. Free promotion, which is super strong. 
All right, so we're going to send out Cross here. He is the uh, lowest ranked member of the Red Wake, so he gets the free promotion. Gavin Resch going along with him. Uh, we've got no chance of ambush. That's good. And let's reduce the risks of someone being captured. Very good. Uh, let's continue grabbing these alloys. It's going to be a mission soon, I should imagine. Oh, monthly report. Failed one gorilla op. Completed two dark events. That's okay. Oh, she's nearly filled up. Sabotage the ship. That's fine. And... More likely to capture soldiers in combat. That's better than killing them, so that's fine. We've got return fire. That's all right. Rapid response. Reinforcements on all guerrilla ops. That's all right. Battle premonition. No reaction fire. We receive bonus to dodge defense. The hidden event we can't reveal because we've got no intel. And we've got advanced chrysalid combat. Probably try and get rid of battle premonition. Oh, uh, this month. I also hate how we can't get out of here just to see how our facility is going. Um, we have put in a new yellow card. We'd have to put supply drops are increased. It's boring. And new recruits we don't use, which is boring as well. Um, I suppose we'll take double agent. Will we? I actually don't think we will. Let's get rid of double agent. Uh, I don't really care about under the table. That's alright. Put that there. I really, I really hate these two. They are boring. I think we'll just take that uh, there. That will be fine. Alright, the alien project is in ruins. Uh, not now, not now. We are grabbing some alloys. It's gonna be mission time. Oh. Okay, don't, don't really care. And here is the mission finally. A New Mexico operation. A foolish grave. A neutralized target. Cash and intel. Psionic storm and savage enemies. Alright, the team for this one is gonna be the girls of Valkyria. It is only difficult, so it shouldn't be too bad. Pile of supplies and intel. We've got Psionic Storm and Savage Enemies. Demon Light coming in with the shotgun. Proximity Mine, Overdrive Serum, Core Bar, and a Frag Grenade. Uh, let's actually do the bonding here with Demon Light. Who do you want to team up with? Your choice of Maya, Tenebris, or Rosa. Let's take Rosa Griffin. There we go. Shot of a Demon Light and Rosa there. Next up, Samantha Tickett. She's coming in. Assault Rifle, Gremlin, Tracer Rounds, Flashbang, and Smoke. Any weapon upgrades? Expanded Magazine. Let's take an Auto Loader. Uh, then we got Rosa Griffin. She's coming in with the Vector Rifle, Gremlin, Medkit, Plasma Grenade, and AP Rounds. The Tyrant, Sarah Rakesh. Suppressing Cannon Grenade Launcher, Frag Grenade. Flame Grenade, Smoke Grenade, Flame Rounds. D with the Sniper Rifle, Stim Gun, AP Rounds, Med Kit and Sensor Suite. And Maya bringing the Assault Rifle, Tracer Rounds, Gas Grenade and Med Kit. This mission here will be coming up in the next episode. Hope you join me for it. I've been Mr. Gruffle. This has been XCOM 2.